Okay, hi everyone. This is Patricia Tucker Nawa. And I am back with another Sim Mobile show of Autumn and Casey Brown now. Hazel has left the show and went on through life and started doing uh, massaging all over the world. And so that's what Kat, uh, that's what Hazel decided to do. Hazel decided she wanted to see more in the world, do more in the world. And she wasn't cut out to be uh, in the legacy of this family. She loved the family, but she couldn't go on with the legacy of sharing her body with several different men and making all of these children. She wanted to go on with a successful career life, and that's what she did. And here we have Brielle, guys. Brielle was next. Uh, her uh, uh, Autumn's first child that was living with her grandmother, and she had came home to her mom because her grandmother said she had gotten a little wild and out of hand and whatnot. Well, of course, everyone knows that Autumn was just as wild and out of hand and whatnot, and Autumn barely paid attention to Brielle when Brielle came, so Brielle pretty much helped, you know, was raising herself. And well, she had to TT, uh, Casey, and Uncle Lermy, who, you know, guided her through, too, and, you know, gave her permission to do certain things, parties and stuff like that. She had to go ask them because Mother was too busy um, going on with the uh, Peaches May Brown's family legacy of making a 100 children. And right now we are now at number... Five, I believe. Brielle was number one. Uh, Cassie was number two. Javon was number three. Uh, Lim is number four. And now we have the new baby. Um, Ashu. Ashu. Ashu, I do believe. Ashu Brown. Ashu Brown, guys. So now we have in the family, uh, we have Autumn Brown, who is the lead legacy of the family since her mother. And then we have, it would have been Hazel, but Casey came next. Casey Brown. Then... There's Lermy Peg, and then there's Brielle Brown, which is Autumn's daughter. Then we have Casey, I mean Cassie Brown, which is Autumn's daughter. Then we have, oh wait, then we have Javon, which is, um, Autumn's son, who is evil, guys, evil. We have an evil one in our family. And then there is Lim Brown that belongs to Casey. And now we have the new generation and new uh, um, transmation into the family, I want to say. Um, this baby is human and alien. So, and this is what he looks like in his mommy's arms. That's what he looked like, guys. <coughs> so, that is what the... Pieces May Brown family has grown to so far. And um, I just thought I wanted to get that out there and get that to be known. And right now, uh, Brielle decided to stop working and going to school. She'll do schooling at home and she will do her guitar lessons to make money and, and have over her uh, baby's dad and other 
male friends that she has to keep her legacy going with. But again, guys, she has a man, this first baby daddy, who is willing to still be with her no matter of the legacy that she has to continue on with. And when it's time for her to actually settle, settle down, he would like to be that man. So right now she has a candidate for being able to marry after her legacy is done or however many children she decides she's going to go on with. She doesn't have to go on with the hundred children, but she has to help with the hundred children. And um, that goes pretty much for all of them. If they only have one, that's their, you know, they, they at least grew our generation and different aspects of cousin, nieces, aunties, uncles, for, uh, you know, just great aunt, great nephew, great this, great that, and, you know, so on and so on. So, that's what's going on in this room at the moment, guys. And we're going to go check on crazy old, uh, Chavon here. I'm going to be able to hopefully say, let you guys see what I mean by he is a little deranged here. Uh, but we tried to give him all the love that we could. And most people, you know, spent as much time with him as they could. But he would definitely get into a mode and walk away from everyone and just go off to himself. So there was always going to be something special about Javon here. We just didn't know what it was, and we kind of learning him now as he gotten grown. And um, honestly, when it's time to demote and promote, Javon will not be one that will come back to the family. So I really do think after uh, Brielle's baby grow up out of the bed, uh, um, Autumn definitely should be trying to have her thing set up for having her next baby by her next candidate. And I'm not sure which one it's going to be, but she just needs to build a foundation here. I'm sorry, guys. I have to check this nail. But hold on. Well, this is what we got in the mail, a cupcake. Great. We needed that. Something we really needed came in the mail. And this is K uh, K Cassie. She has gotten so big and beautiful. Her face never changed. As you guys can see, she just got older and prettier. She is just gorgeous to me with them big pretty lips. Do she got freckles? No. But I do believe Brielle does. One of my girls or somebody in my family had freckles. Yes, Brielle has freckles. Uh She don't have freckles, so I'm pretty sure her son might not have them either. Nope. Do you have freckles? No, you don't. I don't think she should make any more children with this man. She don't really know him and didn't really, you know, learn a lot about him. So I really don't think she should put another one of his children on the earth. But I really do know she needs to be 
you know, getting herself ready for her next candidate. But she really wanted him to see his children. And you see his son won't talk to him. I'm going to try to get mom to go and talk to uh, hey, um, Cassie. And see if dad and son will talk. I'm not sure if he will because he's pretty upset with his dad for not being there for him. And he was alive and around and whatnot. And he looked at the dad. And like, so you really just going to stand over there and don't say nothing to me. Ignore me like, okay, I'm going I'm to I'm I'm woo-hoo to that. I'm going to laugh at that because you funny. <laughs> Why would you do that to your son, though? You want to make him feel bad because uh, Cassie came and told you he made her cry and made her feel bad. You know, he said, no, I'm going to be an angel about it. I'm going to be an angel about it. This is my son. He said, no, I'm going to be an angel about it. This is my son. Son, I don't know what's going on, but, hey, I'm here now. We can have all the fun you want to have. You're grown. We can go out and do things together now. And, hey, it's whatever you want to do, son. But, uh... I understand if you're upset and everything like that, but I'm here when you want me, son. Hooray. Clap it up to that one. <laughs> Stop making that crazy. Stop doing that to your son. Because he being funny. He definitely is being funny. And look, his son can't even face him, but they are talking. But he can't even face him. He said, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm an angel. <laughs> I'm a good boy. He said, but I made some kids. And with a famous girl. Well, she ain't famous yet. She ain't had kids by me and one other guy. But the other, the other, the other guy, baby, didn't make it. So you can't, I guess you can't count that. All three of these kids is his. So I guess you can't count that. You gotta have the ones that's actually here. So. I just want him to see if your daddy and me, daddy and brother, brother wasn't in there killing each other. He ain't paying him no attention. And he ain't paying him none. Now he sat down and talked with his daughter, but he has not talked to his son. He's sitting there watching. He didn't turn the TV back on. He's like, I ain't, I ain't studying this boy. I'm finna watch TV. That's one of my favorite shows. Can't be treating your sister like that and saying forbidden words to hurt her feelings. And you know I don't even allow those words in my house. I don't care how old you think you are, but you don't say those forbidden words. And here's Cassie to prove that you said it. But Cassie ain't thinking about you. Cassie is sitting up 
trying to dance and do her and mind her business because she's not on that garbage with you. I'm getting back to watching this movie too. This movie really is cool. Oh, are we playing a game now? Oh, they, they, they wanted to play a game again. She's like, I didn't mean to get in your way, Cassie, but hey, your daddy's trying to challenge me to a game. resumes I had to keep filling out. It just takes so much time, you know? But then, a job offer. And she told me about how she found a job within just a few days. First, sure, just another job app. But I tried it out and the application process was so easy. And the best part is that I got a job within two days right now. So I a job right now. I highly recommend using the app. Check it out in the app store right now. Ha, ha, ha. 
Well, he can't even, he got to catch that one o'clocker. Oh, my God. Well, how many bars do I need? 
Maybe she should turn around and think about it and come back in. And if not, she will see you again. So he's trying to get rid of this Lima flu. And he's trying to find out which one of these patients has the Lima flu. Well, he just caught a lot of one o'clock. Well, one, 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 one to one thirty. He did a lot of patients. I mean, 8.30, no, yeah, 8.30 to 9.02, or 9 o'clock, really, but 9.02. Oh, you got a good one. I'm sorry, I just made y'all watch that. If y'all didn't want to see it, but sometimes you got to put a little bit of commercial in your stuff. Well, he got to go home and check on his family and stuff. Then he's going to go in the house and wash his hands immediately. Uh, what is Cassie and Jay Vaughn doing? They are like blood, blood, brother and sister. They got the same mother, same father. This is, yes, her original hair color. She was born a, 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 a honey blonde when she was born. And it stayed honey blonde. Her eyes are green, if I'm not mistaken, or hazel. They're hazel now. They used to be green. They're hazel. Now they're hazel. And they used to be green. And what color is his eyes? I think they brown like his daddy's. Yep. His eyes is the color of his daddy's. And look at her baby. Like, she has not put her baby down yet. And what color is your eyes, little boy? Green. Your eyes are green. What color is your mama eyes? Your eyes are brown. 
Your eyes are brown. And your sun eyes are green. Or are they brown too? Oh no, his eyes are brown. What color are your eyes, baby? Real green or blue or gray? Eyes are blue with freckles in your face. It's Brielle that got the freckles in her face. So I knew one of um I don't kids have freckles. Somebody had freckles in it is Brielle. Brielle is so pretty. And she like, I do gotta go use the bathroom and take care of myself, baby. You know, we gonna come walking over in here. Cause he heard them over it cause it's a, a window. And he saw them. He went, hey, baby. Crazy boy. I guess they are just talking about the day and how she spent so much time with um um Javon before he grew up and then she went after he grew had his birthday um she went straight to our son Liam and just been spending time with him and all morning he she was spending time with Liam and now it's daddy's turn because mommy got to go and take care of mommy now and mommy needs a break and needs some sleep time and her time and everything She's like, I'm ready to get comfortable. I'm ready to put on some shouts and brush my teeth. I'm taking a shower and change my clothes. I'm putting on something relaxing. Let him shout it. Hey, that look great to me. <coughs> Put my little flip flops on. Yep. Oh, let me change my color, my bracelet. So at least the color of my shorts. And my hair can stay up in the ponytail. Just want to be comfortable.
brother and sister doing? Just standing here. Okay. So that's what we do around here now, huh? Where's your mom? Out here with your dad. You haven't stepped out to have a little conversation, huh? Who are you? I think you should be in the blue one. She always gonna be friends with him. Cause that really is her first love. But she really do gotta get him over here now. See all these people she got and that she gotta deal with. She gotta... Wait a minute, ain't that her, dude? Oh, no, she ain't got nobody else. That's right, she don't got no... Wait. So this was you tied up in that triangle? Oh, yeah, this is um Skylar. She got to keep in this building up her stuff with Skylar, too. Huh? Could you go in there play that for me, please? This time I'm finna try to eat. But bring me the hot sauce too when you come back. What the hell is this? Oh, sorry guys, did it again. Ask about their day, why not? Don't know much about their day. What's up, lady? Hello? 
Hold on. Yeah. Hi. 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 Hello? What you doing? Oh, I was fixing the phone. Finna eat my food? That's what I'm getting ready to do, eat. That's what's up, lady. That's what's up. I'm I'm still playing my um I'm playing my uh Sims Mobile right now. The alien the alien slash human baby has been made. Yes, it's here. Yeah, they love their baby. She is in love with her baby. She wanted to bring a odd something odd into the family, and she did it. And she gonna marry him at the end. Of, at the end of all, of, all of, after all after she make all the babies, she gonna make he gonna be the one she marry in the end. He already agreed to it. He in love with her too. But she told him she is in a legacy. And I'm recording and this is going on the recording, but that's a good thing. But anyway, she um she um let him know what she was doing. You know, as far as the family legacy. She has to she's going on with her mother's legacy because her mother will be leaving soon. And someone gotta keep the family the Peaches May Brown legacy going. And she wanted to be one of them ones, and that's how she ended up in the house. And um Anybody that's going to be in the house is going to be the ones to uh, grant, be granted the Peaches May Brown legacy, which is making a hundred babies. So anybody that inherits the house has to do the, has to have a hundred babies. They just got to have a lot of kids. They just got to try to have a lot of kids. Cause nobody really gonna make it to the hundred kids. So what's gonna happen is each person that make a baby adds on to the legacy. Oh, until so they end up getting uh, having a hundred kids in total. Yeah. Well, that first woman put a thing in on She had like seventeen kids or some shit. Well, my uh, my person didn't. Autumn only made it to three kids. Somebody you had had twelve kids. That was before Autumn. Yeah. Remember the lady that got pregnant and she was forty something. He was like, "Damn, they just showed me something new." Who was that? Are you you doing the same thing I be doing? You mixing virtual family. You mix, mixing virtual family with the Sim. Okay, so I'm talking about the Sims. You talking about the virtual family girl? Right, we had the twelve kids. She, she had yeah, she had a baby at the age of forty two. And Autumn and them is on the Sims. Yeah. Well, you got to tell me which story you want to because I don't know what the fuck Autumn is on. That's why I said the Peaches made Brown. I don't know what story she was on. Oh. Uh, on the Sims. I said. Now I know she was on the Sims. If you watch my videos, you would have known that too. Actually, I'd love to, but I'm going to have to watch this guy. No, I have not been on that. I did just my, my uh, messages I was 
So I just deactivated my whole page and I'm gonna leave it like that for some time. When I get back on that, you won't even be thinking about me no more. Exactly. Exactly. I know that's, that's right. Insane, that's what I'm gonna have to do. Look like. I don't blame you. So, no I just fucked up to keep having to go. Oh well, that's on them. And a whole bunch of people don't have my number. They don't need it. Thank you. He promised to do more work with you. He promised. And I promised to do more work with you. Hold me up. I ain't doing nothing, girl. I beat Dollar ass. I came back from getting Lewis, went to the gym. I let Dollar out. He was under the crate, so he wouldn't tear his bed up and shit. I came back, I let him from up under the crate. He ran over there and got some water, he got some food, and then he pissed right in the middle of his bed. He didn't even attempt to go to the bus bed. And he didn't piss while he was under the crate. He waited until I let him out to be in the bed. Y'all beat the fuck out of that bitch. He probably over there dead. Damn. What are you guys up to today? Damn, Dollar. Run! I told you to run for your life. Okay, sorry again, everybody. I keep having to leave you guys for a second here. Well, where's the house? Oh, okay, all the way over here. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I'm so funny tonight. But anyway, guys, oh, we're still playing with babies. He's still talking to his son. Um, these two are still not talking to each other. Wow. This this son and this son and father like has no eye for each other and I can't believe they daddy still in the house and she got she got uh Skylar she got Skylar outside Oh my goodness No Skylar is outside with Autumn and Autumn baby daddy still in the house trying to talk to his son but they, they, they I mean they not really getting across to each other no not yet she cannot take him in the house 
and he is in here. So she's going to, but it's, she's still going to get caught if he decides to come out the door. Wait, can they go in the backyard? Wow. They can't even go sit back there in the back. Well, come in the kitchen because I don't think he should do that one. When in the sitting area, actually. We got to put lights through the house. We ain't got no lights. I forgot about that, y'all. We just got up on a thousand dollars, too. But we don't need to mess with that money just yet. Let's see, chat about family. Yeah, cause she she ready to make her baby with him, and she's ready to get this over with and done, so she can hopefully make another candidate. Now everybody again will not make it, cause Javon is not gonna come back. We're gonna uh, demote him, and we're gonna promote Cassie. And we're kind of probably end up be putting a new person in as well for Cass. I mean, for um, yeah, for Cassie. Cassie probably going, or I'm gonna let Cassie go around and look and see, you know. And then if she decides she wants somebody from school, then then it'll be that or somebody from camp or you know whatever she decides. So, right now, at the moment, we're just really watching and trying to see what's going to happen here. And he's not budging. He's, like, not trying to leave at all. It's like he knows that she has someone else here. Why didn't you wait till he left, Autumn? Wow, you're bold.